It's uh, Sam Castles. It's um, the character I play, Noah. Um, my little sister in the film, she gets kidnapped when we're really young. Uh, she's about five. Uh, kidnapped from a beach parking lot randomly. And she comes back ten years later and she's mute randomly. She just gets dropped off like at a diner. And uh, our family has descended into poverty. And, you know, that's why it's called Sand Castles. Is the tragic wave of life you can break it down. But it can always be rebuilt but never the same. So she comes into this broken home, and you know we're still fighting our own demons, and she obviously is full of mystery, but it also triggers a cat and mouse game from my uncle, uh, the guy who plays my uncle, uh, uh, he, used to, he was an ex-cop, and this was a case he could never let go. So there's a lot of dynamic and you know uh, about the human condition in it and it's drama thriller. I mean is this your first film? Or? Uh, it's my first uh, feature as a writer producer usually I'm an actor only but I just as an actor I couldn't find uh, proper scripts or ones that like that got passed to me at the, my level of up and coming yes. you know that I really wanted to sink my teeth into. I've done films where you put so much in and you get such little back. Mm -hmm. what, it, what do you want audiences to take away? What's the message that, that you're trying to to give with this film? Uh, about no matter how uh, tragic life can be sometimes, that there's always uh, hope, there's always light there, light out of the darkness. Mm -hmm. um, and just, it's, uh, it's got a lot of, just about the human condition and about, um, you know, everybody has troubles, everybody goes through things, and you know, you should take what you have with such, I don't know, gratitude, waking up every day. It's, uh, it's got a lot of philosophical themes in it.